Hey everybody, welcome to Let's Cats. We're playing some uh, stories, Path of Destinies. And I am trying to find this like weapon piece, we weapon armature. Hide real quick. Okay. Yes, there we go. Bam. Gotcha. Now, those guys, if they see you, then they will burn you. So I am not going to get myself burned. Like the kid who I was trying to save did. He got burned. Huh? That was not fine. Hey, that was new. Most people still use doorknobs. <laughs> hey, Eva. Oh gosh. Dangerous. No gosh. Oh, my gosh. That was close. He almost burned me. The people or I guess who he did. built this castle. Did they even know what monstrous weapon lay hidden within their walls? The Sky Ripper could destroy anything it touched, or so the legend said. As the Transcendent Emperor had nice. fought the Lost Gods, thousands of thousands had died. But Renardo had been through wars. The only merciful war was a short one. Well. Renardo's blood was up. He just needed to smash something. <laughs> oh, it's doing the Bastion thing where, uh, where it talks over what I'm doing. Oh, right, I have to use the altar to learn skills. Nice, so I can dash now. Wait, why don't I have... I... Oh, come on. Perfect strike. Def okay, I just wanna... I wanna dash. I really do. Hmm. Does this give me experience? I don't think so. How do I know how much experience I have? Hmm. Hero wall, hero uh, sword. sword, ice wall, ice wall, ice, ice cube. cube. Oh, jeez. Nice. This is really cool. No. Oh my gosh. Brad, okay. Renata felt ready to jump faster, stronger, no. older. If only he could figure out which. Well, it'd be nice if I could, you know. If I leveled up a while ago, it would have been useful. I'm only finding help. I'm trying to see if I can find gems. Oh, you can break this bench. You can only find help. I'm not that bad at video games, guys. I want to go back. I need to look. Use the altar. There's something here. Something here as well. What is this? Wrong sword. <laughs> cool. Uh, this this doesn't look. Oh, cool beans. Let's see. Some wind essence. Some water essence. Some skulls here, can I break them? I'm not sure what just happened, but I just dashed to counter at nothing. Okay. Trying not to fall off. What is this? The truth behind the Sky Ripper is shrouded in thick fog. The most believable tale is that the Transcendent Emperor has used a Sky Ripper to banish Iblis. Then T.E. buried the weapon and vanished. Was it self-imposed exile to rid the world of its last divine presence, or was it just was the price to pay for using such a tremendous power? Could a Sky Ripper and Iblis have a deeper connection than just a weapon and its victim? My rituals will summon the Iblis Stone. I perhaps should worry that they will also cause a Sky Ripper to resurface. If that is the case, I should spare no resources. To find it, a weapon can, that can banish a god is invaluable. Bargaining chip, should the old ones decide to double cross me. It, it is in their nature to try. But the gods are predictable, and I can rely on that to always be one step ahead. Emperor Isengrim 3 Secret Journal. Ice walls only let you through if they knew you were cool. Alright, narrator. You can take a break. Jesus Christ, with those puns. Those puns of yours. No one wants puns. No one likes puns. Everyone likes puns. If you don't like puns, there's something wrong with you. I like insert the sword below the sword slot, which is really funny. 
I'm wondering if it's just my computer, if that's just how it is. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Let's do it. Oh no. That was Yeah bye. Cool. Ha! Bet you never saw that coming. His jokes. His jokes. His jokes. Hmm. Wait, what? Huh? There we go. Alright. I can just run around. Oh! I can I can attack them from above? Oh, it wasn't letting me. Hmm. Can I, like, go up here? Why is this even... Okay. Fine. Okay, I guess I can't go in there either. If only I had a dash. Oh, you shall not pass. Don't even. Oh. Cool. I was gonna try to pick one up and throw him, but, uh... I forgot that you could do that. <laughs> Something doesn't feel right. What is this? Well, whatever it was, it's broken now. What was the point of this gate? Did they think no one would notice the lever? Well, I think I just did it in the correct order by accident. Let's uh, see what's all the way over here. Well, it's fire gate. I almost have enough for a fire sword, too. Which would be really nice. I'd like to use one of the elemental swords already. Hmm. What's this way? Treasure chest. Some ore and more wind essence. I can definitely upgrade my sword now. Oh, I lied. Never mind, I cannot. I need five more wind essence. Who needed bridges, anyway? Is there a... Hmm. Interesting. Why was that even there? Just, just a nice stroll over some, uh, thin bridges. You know, everyone likes some of those. It was nice. starting to come back to him. Something you never completely forgot. Like, how to freeze time when attacking. Press L and A to fought, dash. The more he'd probably remember. Dashing consumes stamina. Is that all I need to know? Oh, I need another skill point. Oh, now I can just slow down time after a successful counter to, until your next action. That's cool. Perfect strike. Attack immediately when the previous attack hits to land a perfect strike. Okay. Aggressive defense. Countering an attack now causes damage. Increase maximum health and run faster. Um, I like the idea of being able to run faster, but I need two skill points for that. Whoa, that was a really cool dash. Oh, here it is. There it was. Sky Ripper's armature. It wasn't that hard to get the here. Stuff that dreams are made of. Engineers' dreams, anyway. The device was intricate. No one alive had the skill to make a thing like it. Okay. How is it part of a weapon at all? He'd, he'd have, have to, to ask, ask a scientist. scientist. But first, he'd get the second piece. Sky, Sky Ripper, Ripper had a heart. heart. A core that had come to rest on the next island. Okay. Well, there was another island he could reach. Zenobia had just invaded it with her father's raven battalions. She must be encamped there still. But fighting Zenobia now... That made no sense at all. He'd already sacrificed one friend to get this, this armature, was it? He didn't need to hurry to face her. She would find him. <sighs> Some inexplicable reason, Reynardo chose Zenobia. Reynardo has found the armature of the Skyreaper without the core. It would just be an empty and useless shell. Maybe he should go see Zenobia, who had just invaded city nearby she was emperor's adopted daughter 
greatest general, but she was also his old friend. Narnor didn't know why, but he felt the urge to go see her. Okay. The only re reason one would seek the armature was to build a legendary weapon that had once banished the lost gods. Obviously, Reynardo should get, should get the core. I feel like I should stick with this storyline. But I also feel like this is very dangerous. And I already, I already sacrificed one friend, but... Hmm... Alright. It was a no-brainer. He'd sacrificed his old friend Lapino to get the armature. I'm sorry, Lapino. And the armature was useless by itself. Only a series of coils and wheels. War demanded sacrifices. And he would make more before the end. He would have to choose the greatest good, no matter how much it cost him. I'm already regretting so no this storyline. Well, he would see her sooner or later, across a battlefield or a sword's point before all this was over. He was sure of that. Hmm. The power was in the core. Obviously, he had to get the core. I wish I got the core first. Cool. Doubt sunk in before he was even out of sight of the Farfarer. Why had he chosen the Sky River? It was the sort of path he'd always avoided. Why is it following part me? Part of responsibility. That's weird. Of seriousness. Had he grown up? He didn't feel grown up. He'd made this decision from his gut, like he always did. Somehow, he'd impulsively decided to stop being impulsive. Did that make any sense? <laughs> I impulsively decided to stop being impulsive. Get the Sky River Core. I think my next playthrough, I'll be impulsive. But this playthrough, I guess... I guess I'm just being... Just following the torn path. Um, torn path that's not very torn. What was really fun was hooking yourself onto a moving ship. Cool. Some water essence. Oh. Oh, I teleported myself. Oh, back here. Okay. Very interesting. What's this? Hmm. Oh, a treasure chest. I'm glad I didn't jump down yet. Yet. I wonder what I could make with all these sword crafting materials, thought Renato. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe, uh crazy bandana maybe a uh, a sword crafting table but not the swords themselves okay I, n I didn't expect an island to be at the bottom of a well of a well usually you expect a uh, water you know hmm. oh I can use two dashes because those that's my stamina bar. Cool beans. Nice. There was something sour in the air. Like the earth had ruptured over something that had been fermenting for a very long time. Mm. That sounds stinky. Like sulfur. Which smells like rotten eggs. There's gems around here, it seems. You'd think I'd just, like, you know, get onto that. Where are we? The floor is floating. Floating islands makes me think oh, of, uh... Kill the fox! Cord the ravens. At least I do original. <laughs> Whoa. Don't you dare. Okay, okay. Did I get all of them? Show me there your moves. There were fewer and fewer trees. There were only these huge crystalline growths. Had those been here before? He no longer heard birds except for the feverish cawing of the raven hmm. when they attacked. He couldn't smell the small animals of the forest. The mice and rabbits. Oh, there's a thing here. Where are they gone? And he was getting hungry too. 
This was an unhealthy place to mm. be. Mm. I kind of want to get defensive reflexes. But what's this one? Perfect strike. Attack immediately when the previous attack hits to land a perfect strike. Hmm. Sounds interesting. Let's just he keep going in order. His old skills. He welcomed them back like it was at a reunion. Well, it looks like I can't go this way. I guess I'll go the obvious way. I like dashing. It's really cool. This is really weird. The perfect strike, like, pauses. Oh man, that was really dumb of me. Oh man, these guys are also really good. I keep underestimating them. Nice. I lost some of my health though. Could have done better. Let's go this way. Oh, I guess I can't dash upstairs. That was way too easy. The twenty-sided core made him feel physically sick. Once he had sneaked into a temple of mm. the dark arts, and he hadn't liked what he smelt and saw there, this felt like that. As quick as he could, he wrangled the icosahedron into the armature. Icosahedron? You knew spin. what to say? Then glow. The sick feeling quickly spun away. Now he only felt sad. He had lost <sighs> good friends for this war apparatus. He carried his prize back to the Farfarer. Now he had to make his next move. There was a key Imperial outpost on the Nexus. If this really was some sort of super weapon, he could use it to wreak havoc on the enemy. And if it wasn't, well, better to know that before the final battle. But maybe he should show it to some scientists first. There was an observatory on the Nexus. Maybe he should go there before he fired it. Huh. Okay. Now this is where I don't know. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go seek help from the scientists. Well, of course. If you've just assembled a weapon out of legend that can exile gods from the world, you'd want to have a scientist or two look at it. And even if they disagreed and he had time, he could ask Calaveras himself. Okay. Yes. The observatory would be his objective. Hmm. Now he took a branching path. Now I'm very curious to what's going to happen. But we'll figure that out next time. And I'll see you guys then.